hello guys and welcome back so now in this video we will be adding the player jump so for that we will be needing to open up the player movement script again and right here down below this player movement we will create a public float which will be by the name of jump force and the jump force will be equals to 2 by default okay then if we scroll down to our update method right here after this handle gravity now we will handle the jump right here okay if you want you can create a separate method for this but i will just do it in the update method okay so what i will do right here is i will say that if the jump button is pressed and also if the player is standing on the ground then we will add the jump force so that the player go up in the air but first of all let me show you the jump button if we check the edit project settings input manager right here you will find this jump button which is set to space okay so close this down and then right here we will say input dot get button down okay and right here we will say if that button is the jump okay and it is pressed and then if the player is grounded then what we're gonna do we will say velocity dot y equals to math f dot square root okay we will take a square root of the jump force multiply that by minus 2 and then multiply that by the gravity that is it okay now if you save this get back to unity click on player there is the jump force okay let's play the game and now if you try to press the jump button as you can see the player is jumping okay you can decrease the player jump uh, jump force value if the jump is a little bit high okay i think one will be a good value for our jump okay or oh, let's just make it as 1.5 that is it okay stop the game change this to 1.5 and also inside the script as well where is it jump force okay so 1.5 all right so in this way you can add jump jumping to your own player okay now with this done in the next video we will be adding the footstep sound to our player 